Hey guys, Jeff Spice from uh, Think Youth Ministry and WorldsApart.org. Glad that uh, you're checking us out today. Here's an update for you. Uh, several weeks ago, we had an outreach with uh, over 300 kids, and uh, we showed the movie To Save a Life. And uh, here it is. Woo! To Save a Life. We, uh, we showed it as a, a specific outreach event, and uh, this movie was a great movie. Now, if I was to go to a movie theater, I love rating movies. I use uh, Flixster.com, and I rate all the movies that I go and see generally. Um, the great thing about uh, To Save a Life is that it basically lays a great foundation for discussion afterwards. They have a lot of leadership uh, discussion guides that you can get from their website that are not only free, uh, there are ones that you need to purchase. Again, they kind of go overboard, I think, in my own mind. Uh, it, it's kind of alpha youth extreme uh, in regards to the things that you can purchase. You can purchase bracelets. You can pur purchase posters. You can purchase uh, music. You can purchase a whole bunch of different things. But if you just stick to the basics of what this movie does and the message of this movie, um, I would probably give it a B plus, maybe A minus, in regards to a movie. Now recognizing that it is a outreach film and it's geared to impact and influence kids with where they are as far as students today. We had a range of students right from uh, junior high right through to college that saw it and uh, with youth workers in there obviously and youth pastors it was a great great event. Uh, kids were challenged with the topics that were uh, discussed. Now the thing about it is in regards to the topics that were discussed, one they hit everything. So I kind of, I'm saying that they kind of use napalm in regards to all the issues that they hit. Uh, they hit everything from uh, pregnancy to divorce to binge drinking to drugs to suicide uh, to cutting to dating issues to clicks to not fitting in to popular kids to athletics and uh, the list goes on and on and on. Um, so it's very much a napalm shotgun approach. Uh, they're not going after one specific issue. They're hitting students and they're trying to hit students with where they are today and the things that they're facing, whether they are going through that personally or whether they know someone that is going through that. And uh, it's a great opportunity for you to not only take your kids to see this, um, but I would also encourage you to involve the parents of your students to see this so they can actually see uh, the life of their students and what they're potentially seeing not only in high school what they're going through but also what they uh, might be experiencing within the youth ministry of your church because they hit that as well so I would uh, I would encourage you to uh, see it now I've had a couple of people ask me questions as far as youth pastors and say now what what about the language what is the language like in the movie here's the two words or that one is a word and one is a phrase in the movie these are the the worst things that you're gonna hear in this movie the one is damn it and the other one is bang your girlfriend that's it if if you as a youth worker parent uh, youth pastor uh, if you watch Two and a Half Men, if you watch Simpsons, if you watch Family Guy, uh, if you watch uh, uh, CSI, uh, a lot of those are going to have worse language in them than what this movie does. So the language in this, I have no problem with the language in this. The themes and the topics are tougher to deal with. So you need to be prepared to talk with your students afterwards, you need to be prepared to uh, uh, the gates, the potentially floodgates are going to be opened for you as a youth worker in regards to this uh, this movie with what's going to be discussed in the movie, what's brought up in the movie, what's dealt with in the movie, what's left undone in the movie. And I would actually, uh, I would be willing to see it again uh, with kids. I'd be willing to see it again. It's not an entertaining movie. Uh, it's a great movie for uh, just opening up the door to express, getting kids to express, one, potentially the issues that they're facing in their life, their friends are facing in their life, and how they can move beyond that. So there you go. That's my, uh, my review of the movie To Save a Life. So I would encourage you to see it. I would encourage you to rent it. If you need to get a special license, uh, check it out. Um, you can go to uh, Outreach Films in the States and uh, help, it, help, uh, 
help them and you can get a special license to potentially show it in your area. Um, if you do want more information about that, um, you can click on the link below and it'll take you to the trailer of uh, To Save a Life and uh, you can check it out to save a life dot com or uh, movie to save a life movie dot com or uh, dot ca uh, we'll have the links there below uh, this review thanks a lot and have a great day